family. I, I, I think this is a, Elkhorn is a place where families live together. I think uh, people originally came out to Elkhorn because it was way out and, and far away from the, the city, and they came here to raise families and have extended family. And I, I think that feeling still exists. Part of being in a city, being a community, is the extra things that, that make a community not only survivable, but a place that you want to live. Parks, and you're talking about recreation facilities, pools, and a performing arts center is part of that as well. And we think that's an, as important as keeping the streets repaired and keeping uh, the police and fire on the streets protecting us. It's all part of the livability of a community. Boy, you know, public safety is just key for everybody here in El Cajon. It's our job to give them the best equipment, the best training. Our fire department, part of the Heartland Group, it's a class one ISO fire department. You know what that means? It's in the top 1% of the country. Let me tell you about our police department. It's not just the calls for service. They're out there proactively helping our kids in our community doing great things. We have a balanced budget and we are real careful about spending money, but we're also real careful about bringing new business in. So we've had a lot of success with lots of restaurants, lots of housing. Over 250 houses are currently under construction. And that's all part of the life that I think you see in the city. It's, it's important that we keep things moving forward or cities tend to stagnate. One other big thing in El Cajon is, of course, the reopening of the Magnolia. And uh, I said, well, you've either got to fix it up or you've got to tear it down. And thank God we finally fixed it up. And it's doing a magnificent job for the city of El Cajon. I like the diversity. I like the fact that I could walk across the street from City Hall and get Thai food, go down the street and get Middle Eastern food. I can uh, go to authentic Mexican markets. Uh, it's like a mini United Nations right here in El Cajon and everybody gets along really well. You walk around these, these events, uh, like the Mother Goose Parade and kids getting candy and getting their faces painted and neighbors talking and building relationships and getting inter introduced to people they had never even met. And that's why we spend so much investment in our recreation department so we can build a community that knows each other, that trusts each other and that can work together. 